In this video, we are going to talk about the commonly used features in Power BI. So after you open your Power BI software, this is the interface that you're going to see. So what you need to do first is to close this start screen so that you can be able to see the features. So I'm closing the start screen. So you're getting this interface here. The first feature that we want to learn how to use it is uh, this feature called get data. This is the feature that I'm talking about, get data. So uh, get data are, is used for selecting and configuring data sources. So if you want to import data from several sources, it can be from Excel, it can be from a database, it can be uh, in the form of a text, it can be in the form of a JSON file. All what you need to do is to click on this feature called get data. We shall see how to import data from several sources in our next session. Another feature that I want us to look at is uh, this feature called report view. So report view, um, this is the feature that is used for designing data visualizations. You can see several data visualizations here uh, that you can use starting from the uh, start to bar chart, uh, start to column chart. So if you want to use all these visualizations up to and including the map and the matrix, you need uh, to click on this report, uh, report view. The next feature is the data view. And um, for the data view, uh, this feature provides a view of the data in your model. Typically, it just looks like uh, Microsoft, Microsoft Excel, but it is only read only. We can't really enter data in um, the data view. And then finally, we have uh, the relationship view. And sometimes you may import data that is containing several tables. So if the data is containing several tables, then you will use this relationship view uh, to define relationship among the data tables. We'll be able to see how to create relationships in um, a later session. So those are the, are they, those are the most important features. And then uh, we may have another feature called, um, those are the most important features that you need to understand. It's also another important feature that you need to understand, and this is the uh, edit queries feature. Um, and uh, edit uh, queries feature, this is the feature that launches um, the Power Query Editor. And the work of the Power Query Editor is applying transformation to incoming data. So, um, you need to rename your columns. You need um, uh, to do up with some columns. You'll be able to use um, this Power Query Editor. So when you click on the Power Query Editor, you can see this is the interface that you're getting. Uh, you can perform a lot of data transformations uh, to the data that you want uh, to import. We'll be able to see how to do these data transformations in a later session.